Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. I finally was able to take the face smoothing feature off of this camera. Um, it's currently 1.46 p.m. We have a sleeping girl. I literally squeezed her into this newborn outfit this morning and it just absolutely has to stop. the emotional attachment that I have to her newborn clothes that could no longer fit her is actually insane like I have to I have to do something about that something absolutely needs to be done about that but we're giving her her last wear out of this I have some things in the laundry for her and I have to go through and pick out the newborn stuff because when I do the laundry again those are not gonna be able to fit her again I have some unstoppable beads in my cart on all of these places at this point so i need to order those and have them come today to see if i can do some laundry for myself and for her today um her dad is gonna get her a little chair that i've been telling you guys about just a small seat because she's beginning to sit up maybe i'll pop a picture here on the screen or i'll show you guys when it comes for her so we can have her learn to sit up a little bit better because now all she wants to do is sit up and i'm gonna pop a video on the screen here to show you guys her just trying to sit up at all cost it's an obsession at this point she's obsessed with sitting up but um yeah i spent the morning basically this morning when she had her morning nap i made some breakfast for her dad and i and no when she woke up first i gave her some boob she went back to sleep i watched a lecture and i did a few quizzes and then um i made breakfast when she was when she um was sleeping i ate i watched the lecture then she woke up and like I attended to her, um, that was at like 12 o'clock. Changed her out of her um, pajamas and put her into something else. And then um, I have a few lectures going right now. Well, the same the same subject. I have um, lectures that I'm watching for that. By the time you guys are watching this, I would have either stopped doing these prerequisites or I've completed one or two and we're advancing. And I'm praying that when you guys are watching this, I've completed a lecture or two and um we're moving we're moving on up but yeah so yeah um I'm she's sleeping and I have to hold her up a little bit because she tends to spit up if you know obviously she feeds and you put her down at the same time even after she's burped I have to hold her up for about 15 or 20 minutes and so that is what we're currently doing holding her up a little bit so she can um I really need to get this going so she can start the digestion process of this food obviously the food does not digest in 20 minutes but it's better than putting her down soon as she um maybe 10 minutes soon as she eats so yeah i'm gonna put her down see she's been sleeping for 15 minutes 35 or 15 50. so yeah i'm gonna put her down I was wondering if I wanted to put her inside of the bedroom or put her on the couch because I want to watch the lectures. So maybe I'll put her inside of the bedroom and hopefully she sleeps for a few hours, maybe until two. She gives me two hours. That's great. So I can finish up the lecture that I'm watching, do a quiz. I need to change the linen in my bedroom. I don't know if I'm going to get to that right now or if I'm going to get to that a little bit later. I can't really tell, but I really do want to finish this lecture up and try to do a quiz and see where it goes from there but for the most part we have gotten the day off to a good start the kitchen is clean everything is nice and clean and um we're just existing right now she's sleeping and i'm existing and i want to go watch a lecture like i said this weekend i'm going out with one of my bestie girls and so i don't know what i'm going to do to my hair if i'm going to put my u part unit on you guys know my u part unit i'll pop it on the screen here or if I'm gonna put a full unit on. I tried it on this morning. I, it's a glueless. I tried it on this morning. I'm gonna pop that hair too so you guys can see. So I'm not really sure what I wanna do yet, but also I have too many things going on. I, the other day I tried the dresses on that I wanna wear and they're very cute. But I have too many things going on right now to do a full everything and try the outfit on and everything. One of these days are gonna have to be a self care day because I have to put on some lashes, see if I have a shade of makeup that fits me at this point. I don't know. And. You know figure out i'm gonna do all of that so i could look cute for bestie girl's birthday on friday 
I want to send her some beautiful flowers so she can enjoy those. She's not a flower girl like me, but still. And, um, and then we're going to go out Friday night and Saturday night, so dad's on daddy duty. But this is going to be my first time like going out since I've had her, so I'm very excited for that too. So there's that. But um, yeah, yesterday was really um, a clean up day. I cleaned up the kitchen, emptied the drainer, bought her dad cook last night, and all oh, the food is so damn good. So we have stuff in the drainer all over again. But I'm not messing with that stuff right now because when she goes down, I do not want to wake her up. So I'm here. I wanted to pop in, say hi, start the vlog. If I'm looking like a toenail, I'm trying to be very much intentional about, you know, getting the content out there. Also, the other day I did a video of her, like a home video. And I've always been interested in those. Since I started vlogging in 2014, I've always liked the idea of having videos that you could show to your kids when they're 10, 15, 20, when they're 30. Imagine her at 30 and I show her that video of us just chilling in the living room, just you know what I mean? And so I was saying it to my sister the other day and she's like, oh, but you're sharing it on YouTube. And I'm like, same thing, you know? You're still choosing, you're still very intentional about what it is that you wanna share. And obviously I have the raw footage on external hard drives too. So they, they will have access to all of that to be able to see what we were doing at this point in our lives. And I absolutely love that. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna go do all that I said that I was gonna do, starting with putting her down. Let's see if it works. You guys, the last couple of nights I have not been doing the greatest with putting her in her crib because it's coming closer to the time where I go back to work. I literally have like a week and I've been so stressed about just leaving her at nights, but I'm thankful too that I do work at nights because that means that when I'm gone to work is gonna be the time that she's sleeping. And by the time I get here in the morning, she's probably just gonna be waking up. And so I'm not missing much except for her sleeping. And I essentially would be sleeping too because that's what we do when I'm here. And so one, I'm grateful for that, but also I think I'm gonna miss her so much. So I'm already planning to overcompensate in the days when I come home and doing all the things with her. Um, obviously she's getting bigger so we can do things like go to a little park around the corner and sit down. And obviously I take her on my little coffee dates. We go to the nail salon, we literally do everything together. And it is so blissful. I'm so grateful for these moments where I get to be able to do that with her and then very soon we're going to be able to do that with both girls. So we're going to have full on girls days and everything. I'm so so excited about that. So that's coming up. Bamia, yeah, I'm going to go finish up this lecture before she decides to take a cat nap and wake up knock on wood. Please don't make that happen. So we're going. Mm -hmm. 